Hey, what is up, Amy? It is Mark McGrath from the band Sugar Ray. Yes, I know. Off the charts, but always in your hearts. And speaking of hearts, Amy, I understand from your amazing, your wonderful and thoughtful and creative husband, Andy Fox, that you have a bit of a milestone happening. You have a bit of a milestone happening on May 2nd, and that is another trip around the sun for our dear Amy, otherwise known as a birthday. So, Amy, on behalf of Andy and myself, Mark McGrath from Sugar Ray, happy, happy birthday. And I gotta say, Amy, Andy could not stop raving about you. Could not stop raving. And he goes, you know what, Mark? Amy is an amazing person. Incredible, incredible heart. She's in the best therapist in the world and she helps so many people better themselves and gives them comfort, makes them better people, uh, saves relationships, saves people's relationships with themselves. She's amazing. Um, and she loves her dog, Barlow. Shout out to Barlow. And this sounds like my wife right here. She loves shopping, shoes and purses. So that means, Amy, your closet must be super filled with purses and shoes. And Andy has probably like one little, one little pull-out cubby for his stuff. Uh, sounds like, sounds about right. Sounds about my, uh, sounds like my house. Uh, and what you miss most, Amy, Andy, let me know about the pre-COVID world is karaoke at the boom box. Come on. Now, I'm curious to know, Amy, what is your go-to karaoke song? That's what I'm curious. I always tell people, if you can't sing, and you know, some have said that I can or can't, that's, that's to be debated. If you can't sing, always go with a rap song like Ice Ice Baby or uh, Bust the Move, because you know, it's got a rap and that always gets the place going. Uh, but karaoke is so much fun. Hopefully we'll be getting back to it. Uh, I'm down in Jacksonville right now. Um, we live in, I live in LA, um, but we're playing tonight. And it's because of people like you, Amy, that we still get to do something we love to do. So it's an honor to thank you, Amy, on your birthday for making our dreams come true and all the love and support through the years for the band. Because Andy let me know you love 80s and 90s music. And so do I. I have a show on Sirius XM, the 90s on 9, Mark McGrath 120, that celebrates the music of the 90s. Uh, so I know what you, I know what you, uh, I know what you feel. So I let Andy know, I go, listen, Amy sounds amazing. I can see why you married her. But I can't just wish her a happy birthday, this amazing person that helps others and loves karaoke, loves her dog, loves shoes and purses. I can't just do that with words. And Andy goes, well, what are you going to do, Mark? I mean, you're probably traveling, and I imagine you don't have your guitar. I go, yeah, you're right, Andy. But that doesn't mean I can't sing happy birthday to her a cappella. Because it wouldn't be fulfilled just wishing her a happy birthday. It's just words. So, Amy, this is for you. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Amy, happy birthday to you, hey, yay Amy, happy, happy birthday. Now, Andy let me know you love every morning, maybe every morning's your karaoke go-to. It's funny, I have tried to karaoke Sugar Ray songs, and they change the keys and pitches on them, and I sound really bad on the songs that I wrote. Uh, so it's just really funny that, you know, I can't even karaoke our own songs very well. Uh, but Andy let me know you love the song every morning. And you know what's great about that song? I wrote that song about my then girlfriend in 1998, especially this part right now that I'm gonna sing for you. Um, we co- I, we, there were, we co-wrote the songs together. There's like three of us that were the main songwriters in Sugar Ray. And we would write different parts together and just put them together and somehow it worked. Don't ask. Um, but I'm gonna sing this part to you and I think this is what, how Andy feels about you, Amy. And these words aren't Shakespearean, obviously. Not gonna win a Nobel Peace Prize, but I think they're right on the bullseye of what Andy thinks about you on your birthday. She always writes the wrong for me. Amy, she always writes the wrong for me. Every morning there's a halo hanging from the corner of my girlfriend's four post bed. I know it's not mine, but I'll see if I can use it for the weekend or a one night stand. Ooh yeah, every morning. Amy, happy, happy birthday. Have a lovely day full of joy, music, 
happiness, maybe some karaoke, Barlow, hope you get shoes and purses and all that good stuff. And of course, the music of the 80s and 90s from your amazing husband, Andy, and your new friend, Mark Rathman Sugar Ray. Take care. Happy birthday.